don't see nobody else. I don't want nobody else. Don't wanna be by myself. You cherished. I love you for who you are. Even though I left some scars, let's fly off to Mars. You cherished. I will never cease to be amazed by God. How is it that nothing can separate us from his love? Why does he pour out his grace and mercy and forgive us for things we find hard to forgive ourselves for? It's crazy to me, but his ways are higher than our ways, the Bible says. And it's that kind of mystery that I explore in my latest novel, Cherished. And what's even more of a mystery is how he wove together so many things in the writing of this story. Here I am writing about these fictional characters, two women who are struggling to overcome the shame in their past. And I'm watching unfold in real life the story of Christian rapper The Truth and his wife Nicole. I read his public statement about how he had broken his marriage vows and how God had shown him the power of forgiveness and restoration. And I said, that's what Cherished is about. That God is a God who redeems and a God who restores. That no matter where you've been and no matter what you've done, God redeems, God restores. He loves with a steadfast love. You are cherished. Be by myself, you cherished. I love you for so for those of you who don't know, the truth, I want to introduce him because you have been one of my favorite Christian rappers and I told you earlier today that I didn't even listen to Christian rap until about two and a half years ago. When my friend, the late bloomer. my friend Tanya, I'm a late bloomer, my friend Tanya got me into it and oh my goodness, your song was the first song, my story. Yeah was the first song that I just started playing over and over. Wow. Posted it on my Facebook page. Wow. And <laughs> was excited that I had discovered you. Wow. And so wow. that was two and a half years ago. And then as I'm writing Cherished and, and seeing all that was happening with you, um, just really started praying for you and Nicole. Yeah. And um, I knew that God would restore it because I, I heard your heart yeah. when I yeah. read about what was going on and saw yeah. your statement. I, I, yeah. I heard your heart yeah. and I knew that God was doing an amazing work. But would you mind sharing oh, not at what, all. what you had to go through? Not at all. Um, uh, as a matter of fact, you know, I get, I, I'm a late bloomer because I just became a fan <laughs> this year of Kim T. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. And uh, Cherish was the first book that I read from you. And um, uh, one of the main characters in the book, Heather Anderson, um, her story is a direct parallel to mine in a lot of ways. Not a direct parallel, right. but there are a lot of similarities. Right. Um, for one, you know, she's a woman um, who had an affair with a married man, mm -hmm. amongst many other things, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. um, but just her, you know, my life, uh, I related to her character because I went through the same thing. Mm -hmm. Of course, I committed adultery. Um, and then, um, you know, after, you know, going through the twist and tone turns of, you know, that uh, extramarital uh, relationship, then she had to deal with the growing, feeling like she was way at the bottom. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. <laughs> hopeless, lifeless, mm -hmm. I, you know, I need help, but yet, mm -hmm. my hope is in God. And so I can relate to her character in that regard too, because, you know, I got to that place where my hope was in God and God didn't leave me there. And he totally restored me. And, and um, provided me everything I needed, you know. Um, hard, difficult, right. rough journey. Right, you right. know, the terrain was, <laughs> That's right. was rocky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but the Lord was with me. Singing on praise to the air flows. And I can feel the passion. The man that was attractive. So you recorded the song, Cherished, yeah. which will be <laughs> on your album coming out, The Whole Truth, which. Yeah. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. <laughs> totally excited about it, and it wow. was totally God. Thank you. I want to hear in your words what you think about the song. Oh, I love the song, um, and I'm not saying it because it's me. Right. Right. It's, it's an awesome <laughs> I song. I just, I just love the song. Yeah. Uh, obviously, it's inspired by the book mm -hmm. uh, Cherish, but it's also inspired by my wife. Mm -hmm. um, and I wrote the song to my wife. Mm -hmm. I wanted to provide my wife with um, 
a, a fresh point of reference, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I have written a song for her before on Open Book that was directly to her, um, but this was something new, something fresh, and mm -hmm. I was trying to figure out what to write for her anyway, and then this book came along, and so this is just for her, it's all about her. Well, has she heard it? Nah, it's a surprise for her. Oh, we gotta go right now. <laughs> we gotta do it. Let's you do it, go, yeah. let's do it. <laughs> I don't deserve you. I'm coming to diamond woman to hurt you. I, I do have a surprise for you. Um, you know, one of the things that I always tell you, I say it every time I preach, you know, when I stand before the people, is that um, there's so much that I've learned about you just over the past two years, you know, um, just about your character, you know, and your commitment, you know, commitment to Christ, commitment to your marriage, your commitment to me. Um, your love for God, your love for me. Um, I told you that um, I'm learning what it means to persevere just by think, reflecting back on how you persevered through our uh, tough season. I got a song here that I want you to hear, and that's it's, it's, feature, it's featuring our big sister. And um, all right, let's, let's just take a listen. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> it's entitled Cherished. Love and cherish you. That's my commitment for the rest of our lives. <laughs> I don't see nobody else. I don't want nobody else. I want to be by myself. It cherished. I love you for who you are. Even though I left some scars. Let's fly off the bars. You're cherished. It will last forever Cherish Nicole, I have been loving that song for months. <laughs> it's been in constant rotation on my iPod. <laughs> <laughs> do you feel cherished having had this song written for you? I do. And now I get to listen to it and get it in my soul and my system, which is, is going to be great. You know? Amen. It's like you know you're cherished, but then to feel cherished mm -hmm. because of something mm -hmm. that Right. It's done for you yeah. is an awesome feeling. I don't want nobody else. Nobody else. I want to be by myself. Oh, oh. And the book is now available wherever books are sold. I hope that you will pick up the book and learn about our awesome God and how he redeems and restores. And I would love to hear from you personally. I am at www.kimcashtate.com. Love will last forever, it will last forever, cherish.